I don't even think a lot of people know I have a child. <laughs> I lost some of the weight, so I don't think people really know that I have a child unless you're really a communications major, so I think they've accepted it. I don't really, I haven't really come across anybody that's had a problem with it. When we first had Shana, we both were really, really scared, both very young. I was still a senior in college. I was just, I just graduated before we had her. But she has been a blessing. Been together for three and a half years. He's here whenever he can, and he helps me put her to bed, and he takes her on weekends when I have a ton of work to do, which is a major help. And um, I don't know what I'd do without him because he just helps me out so much. I feel so much older than I actually am. Like I'm technically 22 years old, but the stuff that I've dealt with in my life is more than most people 25 years old have done and I think I've overcome it um, with a great deal of, of success. Mondays I wake up with Shana um, by myself, Bud stays at his house and wake up with her at 7 on the dot, she's a machine and then have her till 10, I take a shower and I leave here by 10.45, go to school, um, deal with any newspaper stuff that I might have and then I go to school at 11.30, <laughs> and I have the newspaper in, uh, basically all afternoon. And then I go to career prep with Don Francis. Tuesdays, I'm at school from 8.30 a.m. till sometimes 2, 2.30, um, doing newspaper stuff and layout and dealing with the staff writers and stuff like that. Wednesdays I'm off, Fridays I'm off, Thursdays I wake up with her at 7 and then I go to school for two classes and I have story conferences and then I come home and she usually goes to bed around 9.30 and then I'm up doing work until like 12, 12.30. Um, I look forward as much stress and as much hassle as the paper can be. Um, I like, re I really look forward to classes. Um, but I love, I love the feeling of looking at the paper and being like, I was a part of that. So I think that's why I really involve myself with that. The hardest part was just not being able, like, I have no life Monday and Tuesday. And then Thursday I spend a lot of the time with her, but not, it's not the peak hours that she's usually the most fun. Um, I feel bad when on weekends Bud's here and he'll want, us to both play with her, but I have so much work that I need to go upstairs and bury myself in my room and just do my homework and stuff. I help out Kate by doing anything I can. She, she works so hard and uh, we're so proud of her, but if, if I can get home a little bit earlier from work and take Shana's, Shana off her hands from being there all day or um, have my, my dad or mom take her for a night uh, so that we can be kids again and, and actually go out, which is a huge help. But uh, just putting her down every night, waking up with her, she wakes up a little early. But anything I can do. Even if we had a sled. But just to enjoy it too, because we're both parents and we, we just want to take it all in as much as we can. We slid it! Should we go cruising for some good hills? Because this hill's not going to cut it. I, I love being a dad, and she's a great little girl, eight months old. I have a, I have a great girlfriend. Family has been a huge support for all of us. And we just, we take it in every day, and we love it. I think I had wished that I didn't go to St. Joe's to begin college, but if I didn't, I never would have met Bud, and I never would have had Shana, and I can't imagine where my life would be today. Is it?